Namaste student this is Sanjay Nath today's session is on measuring the area on topographic map standard 10 ICSC session 8 in this topic you learn how to calculate or find an area using certain technique now we'll see what are the consideration for measuring an area on topographical map first all the eastings are of 2 cm 1 km apart and all the northings are of 2 cm 1 km apart as you can see on the screen there is a map extract showing a block of 2 by 2 cm or 20 by 20 mm this block represents 1 km by 1 km or you can say 1 km square now on the map this block will represent 2 by 2 cm block the map scale is 2 by 2 cm and this represents or accommodates the information of 1 square km of the ground how much a grid square measures it can be further understood by using a ruler if I bring a ruler between two easting it measures 20 mm by 20 mm as you can see from one easting to other easting towards the east direction it measure of 2 cm or 20 mm if you bring a ruler between two northing you can see it also measures 2 cm towards north direction or 20 mm now we learn how do we measure the area on topographical map using certain technique now in this count the number of grid square for example n number of grids the area would be equal to n square kilometer for example 1 2 3 grids falling between easting and northing this 3 grids equals to 3 square kilometer in this manner one can calculate the area using grid technique or counting the number of grids on topographical map now there is example to make you understand how to calculate the area enclosed within easting and northing as you can see between 26 to 29 and between 58 to 62 northing and easting how much grid is falling so 26 to 29 three grids are coming there is easting and 58 to 62 northing four grids are coming now P multiply with Q, the area enclosed will be 3 into 4, will be total of 12 square kilometer area it represents on topographical map. In this manner, one can calculate the area enclosed within the easting and northing. Based on the previous method or example where the calculation was shown, one can easily calculate the area that is falling between certain grids, like between easting and northing. In this method, the visual method, one can easily calculate the number of blocks falling between easting and northing. This method is very easy. After one or two practice, one can easily calculate the number of grids in an even manner on a particular map extract. As you can see, as per our question, 26 easting to 29 easting and from 58 northing to 62 northing, what would be the area? In this, if you see, the total number of blocks falling between the easting and northing is 1 to 12. So these many blocks represent these many square kilometers. So there are total of 12 blocks and this represents 12 square kilometers. In this manner, one can calculate the area on topographical map using visual method. There is another example to make you understand how to calculate or find an area on topographical map. Let's have a look. First understand what this question says. Calculate the extent of forested area enclosed within the easting 43 to 46 and 85 to 89 northing. So keeping in mind this question, we can generate the calculation as you can see easting difference is 43 minus 46, 3 blocks are falling. 84 minus 89 that is northing 5 blocks are falling p multiply with q what would be the answer it will be around 15 square kilometer what do you think this answer is correct once again have a look what the question is asking calculate the extent of forested area do you really think that the forested area is of even shape yes you're right it is not of even shape so, what is the correct solution? 
now there is a visual method to understand how to calculate an area that covers an uneven shape for example this forested area is an uneven shape and as you can see it is shown with or shaded with green color now how to calculate it is falling between easting 43 to 46 and northing 84 to 89 now there is a method by which one can calculate in this method we'll be using a matrix or a table area enclosed by full grid square will code f area enclosed by half grid square the code h area enclosed by more than half grid square code m and area enclosed by less than half grid square code l now this is what happens the number of full block multiplies number of half block get multiplied number of two third block get multiplied and number of one third block get multiplied now we'll learn what would be the total area of uneven polygon shape means how to calculate this total area you will multiply the number of full block will multiply the number of half block with half will multiply the number of two third block with two third and will multiply the number of one third block with one third now we'll learn with the help of visual method how to find or calculate an area of uneven polygon shape as you can see on the map extract there is an uneven polygon shape forested area has been marked or demarcated or shaded now we have to find the area of this particular uneven polygon shape this particular green patch is falling between easting 43 to 46 and northing 84 to 89 now with the help of visual method will give some code to this each block for example in this grid how much the green patch area covers based on that we'll identify it is half full two-third or one-third as you can see in this grid it covers more or less half this will be declared as H followed by that this grid will more or less one-third VL this grid is more or less full this grid is also more or less full followed by this this will be one third more or less full this one is more or less full this grid will be declared as one third and this grid will be declared as two third as you can see for each grid wherever this green patch is falling we have marked with L F M and H now we'll Count the number of full grid, half grid, one third grid, and two third grid. Now we'll use a very simple method to calculate or find the total area of uneven polygon shape or forested area. Now we'll see what are the findings. Full grid, total grid is 4 into 1, that will come to 4 square kilometer. Half grid, 1 multiply with half, it will come to 0 0.5 square kilometer. Total number of two third grid is one, it will come to 0 0.6 square kilometer. And total one third grid is three, it will come to one square kilometer. In this manner, if you calculate or add all these values, you will get total of 6.16 square kilometers. This is the total area of uneven polygon shape of forested area on a map extract. In this manner, one can calculate any uneven shape on topographical map to find an area. Thank you for watching the presentation.